Hey guys, what's up? How y'all doing? I'm here to talk to you guys about Dr. Stone New World, which is on episode 5. This episode right here was actually pretty slick, and I'm looking forward to the next one, because that's when the real, real sailing begins, you know? Okay, that was a lot of minor spoiler, but those of you guys who watched the episode or read, or read the manga, you get the idea. So by all means, let's just get this started. Um, um we have to it that, um... That everyone is actually trying to get ready to build a ship. However, things are not looking so great for the time being, you know. In other words, like, um, I think it's the lack of, like, a manpower or, like, um, the capabilities to try to get the try to get thing try to get things done. We don't really know. But one thing's for certain is that, like, uh, is, like, uh, one thing's for certain is that, like, um, they are, do, they do fear about, like, um, what you may call it. I guess motivation, whatever the case may be, um, or it's just like um, the lack of blueprints or just trying to get things done. I don't know. But one thing's for certain is that Senku believes that we should make something of a small yacht and have people, someone travel, have a small group of people travel over there. However, Ryusei, on the other hand, says no, that's not going to happen. We get to see a little backstory of how like um, he only has a couple as 1 million yen or something, but he uses that to his advantage to, like, um, be strong here and there, get a very good, like, um, workout whatsoever, how to make more money. I guess that's when he's the most greediest man to, like, um, work very hard to try to get things done. We don't really know. But whatever the case may be, <laughs> this backstory of Rusei that we see in him, you know, how he made money in the stock market, how he worked out very greatly in order to get stronger, or he had a personal trainer making sure he's all fit and all, you know, having clothes here and there. I'm like, <laughs> I like that. And then he makes video games here and there. I don't know. Whatever the case may be, all I know is, is like, um, Rusei is not the kind of guy to, like, um, give up, you know, whatever the case may be. Whatever, whatever the case, whatever the case it, whatever the ca whatever the case is, you know, and etc. Um, whatever the situation is, you say when Senku and Rusei really work together, like how Senku and Sukasa work together, they could get anything. They could get anything done. Like they could get a lot of things done. We have we get to know that Francois, you know, Rusei's butler tells every tells everyone that Rusei actually cares for a lot of people here and there. So yeah. Um, we get to see, like, um, what you may call it, um, we get to see to it that, um, Senku and Rusei work together in order to make, in order to make things work out, you know, with the exceptional tools they have, you know, they end up having to finish the ship in about over a year, it took about over a year, there was some fun stuff, chocolate, and then snowboarding, skiing, you get the idea, and as for the journalist woman, you know, she's making a lot of photos right now because she doesn't know what's going to happen when everyone's going to be separated, you know, whatever the case may be. Although, Rusei believes that we could have, like, we couldn't, we can or could try to take everyone with them, but Senku, on the other hand, says, no, we can't do that, otherwise we all be extinct the moment we even set sail, <laughs> you know, because we need to leave some people behind in order to, like, um, keep everything growing and agriculturing, whatever the case is, you know, and so forth. So, pretty much, although it took a long time, you know, they managed to finally get the ship, they finally finished the ship about over a year, and then we get to see a couple people coming along, you know, power team here and there, etc. But, we had to, a Kohaku is actually worried about one thing, and that is the two criminals, which is like, um, whatchamacallit, um, Hyoga and Homura. We get, we, let's not forget that those two, two, like, um, people are chaotic evils, or should I say, I was just saying, one of them just follows Hyoga. I think that's the other guy's name. Yeah, Homer follows Hyoga, which we really don't know why. But all he knows is like um that guy tried to kill Tsukasa, or he actually almost actually did. But Tsukasa is saved by being in the ice ice chest for the time being, you know. And this is where Senku and the others are like um motivated to try to like and find the petrification beam so they can petrify him, release him, and then they and then he could be like restore you know whatever the case is i don't know but one thing's for certain is that like um things continue to like um go on for now i don't know situation but one thing's for certain is that senku and the others decides to bring hyoga and homura to like um whatchamacallit on the ship 
on the ship so they can stay close and that they are not left on the mainland because we all know that those two are very agile and strong, very athletic, physically, etc. And by physical power alone, they could take over the whoever's left behind, you know, etc. Who can't fight. We get to see that um, what's what's the guy Ginro or something or something like that. He ends up having to like him join the group, even though he's afraid to not do so. Although like he swam over there. And Taiju on the other hand gives him a hand. Everyone gives him like a praise here and there. Good job. All right. Now we get to get to. Now it's time to get someone, you know. But we get to know that like um, what you call it that um that the location that Senku wants to go is called is an island that the survivors of the petrification came from. That the survivors of the petrification just like um stayed on, you know. Senku believes over there they may they might be able to find something over there where his father and the others managed to survive, etc. To like um, what you may call it, have useful information or resources. We don't really know, but one thing's for certain is that Senku believes we should go to that location first. You know, so yeah. Next episode is called like um, what you may call it, treasure box whatsoever. So we'll see how this one goes. But I look forward to the next episode by all means. Sorry for being a little confusing here and there. All I can really tell you is that Senku wanted to change, and overall, without a lot of detail, complications, and me being a little confusing here and there, which I always am. Um, Senku wanted to change change the boat the boat size a bit, or I say he wants to because things are not looking so great. But thanks to Rusei and Senku working together along with everyone else with the manpower, they managed to get they managed to build a boat in about one year. You know. Although there are some fun stuff involving like um, swimsuits, chocolate, and snowboarding, skiing, you know, that kind of thing. Yeah, looking forward to like um, uh, next episode where Senku wants to go because he believes that place might have something to be very useful on before they set out to look, go find the wide man. So until then, people, I'll see you guys in the next video. So I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day. I'll see you guys next time. All right. Peace out. Bye-bye. Toot toot.